Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. My name is Vicki and this is my update for the Lip Service Project Pan. This is a Fantastic Ladies um, collab. Excuse me, so you can find the Fantastic Ladies group on Facebook. <laughs> Um, and I'll link them down below and I'll link down all of the details for the, this project. Um, but with that, we will get started. This project was um, actually created by Jessica Lee and Amanda. And yes, I'm reading my notes because I can never remember. So with that, we're going to get started. I have not, let me grab everything. I have not done any videos for this beyond my intro. I've been very busy with work. And by the time I get home on Thursdays to film, it's been, you know, 8.30, 9 o'clock. So, um, you know, but here we are. So I'm not going to go over all the progress I've made, all the uses, things like that. We're just going to talk about the products and my usage for March. Um, so with that, let's get started. Let me find my first item, which is going to be this MAC Lip Liner in Whirl. I've used this nine times in the month of March. It is starting to get shorter. Um, I don't know how it compares to the other, oh, they're both, they're both the same height. Um, I was trying to see if they were maybe different heights, but I really love this. I love these lip pencils. I'm not a lip pencil person. I am like, let's keep it super basic. Don't need any anything fancy, but I had bought a set of three. Um, it was like a a set with three MAC lipsticks, the primer, the prep and prime, and the and then the two pencils. But I will tell you what, I'm really enjoying these pencils. They're nice and creamy, and I have fallen in love with MAC lipsticks. You guys know I'm a gloss girl. I like my gloss, but I have the MAC today. I have the MAC lipstick on today in Creme in Your Coffee. Is that the one I grabbed this morning? Who did I grab? Nope. Creme Cup. Excuse me. Creme Cup. And I really like it. It's, I don't, it doesn't feel dry on my lips. I'm really enjoying it. But anyway, getting back to this project. Um, again, this is Whirl. Used eight times. The goal is, of course, to use that up. The next item I have is my Milk Makeup. Um... This is actually for cheeks or lips. I like it on my lips better um, because you guys know I am not a cream blush kind of girl. Now, with that said, a very exciting whole collection project pan update for April, which will come at the end of this month or early May. But what I will tell you is this. I have a liquid blush on right now, and I'm obsessed with this liquid blush not going to tell you who it's by. You're going to have to wait. But anyway, I do use this as a lip product. As you can see, this is just that mini one that Sephora gave out like umpteen thousand years ago that for some reason this now will not roll up. Wow. Okay. Okay. Okay, Milk, we see you that you don't want to roll up. All right. Well, it does no longer rolls up. So when I get there, I get there. Wow. Okay. And this is just, you know, it's part for the course. My plan was to finish it. I doubt that's going to happen because it's, it's just in there. And that's where it's going to stay. Because um, I have too many other lipsticks I'm working on to really worry about scraping it out. If I get to the end of the year when I've finished everything, am I going to scrape it out? Yeah, I probably will make a lip balm out of it. But there is that. So I did use that four times last month and then now we are moving on to MAC in the color Modesty that is this one right here I mean English I only use this twice out of the three MAC lipsticks that I got in the set this one's my favorite there is something about this color I am just obsessed with um, so I used that one a total of two times in the month of March and then I have the other MAC liner in cork, and cork is what I use with, um, oh, which is it? I know that the work lip, 
work lip product I've been using with the Whirl Liner because they go really well together. And this one I've been using with the creme in your coffee and creme in your cup. Yep. Um, so this is Quarks. Really, really pretty. I should give you some swatches here. Let me let me do that. So Quark. I'm just yapping away, forgetting about the swatches. You know how it is. As you can see, the liners, they are two very different colors. Like one is darker and one is more like that pinky brown. And so Whirl is the one I put on the top. I don't know if I put it on the top. No, Whirl's on the bottom. So I'm going to put this. As you can see, these two kind of go really well together because I can shear it out and blend them. Um, and then with modesty, it's right there. So this this goes really well with um, the world color as well. So that was modesty, two uses, cork liner, two uses. Then I have creme cup, which is this one. I've also used this one twice. This is more on the pinky side. This is the one I'm wearing today. That is it right here on the bottom. I like the color on its own without the lip liner, but by the same token, I do feel like it's a little too light for me, but I'm using it, you know. Creme Cup, which is this one, no, excuse me, we already talked about Creme Cup, Creme in Your Coffee. I used this one four times. Apparently I was obsessed with this one a little bit last month. Um, so as you can see, like, there's kind of a pattern to my colors, which is I lean towards more towards the pinky notes. And here's the other fun one. So I have, of course, this Marc Jacobs lip topper in Silver Surf. I really like this over Whirl. Um, so I'm going to show it to you on its own. Because all you need is a dot of this because it's just, you see how gray it looks. But once I shear it out a little bit, it's like a nice shimmer. So on top of Whirl, which is this color right here, I get my goopy fingers all over the lip gloss. It kind of deepens, it kind of deepens roll up just a tad, but it gives that nice sort of silvery shimmer to it as well. Um, so I'm really, really enjoying that. Um, obviously, all of these are to either use up or just declutter at the end of the year. I've had, I feel like I've had, I feel like I've had the Marc Jacobs one since like 2021, 2022, 2021, because I know I got it before the Mac stuff. Um, so the Mac ones I've had since looking like 2022, and then. That milk makeup one has been with me since before COVID or like 2021. So they're, you know, they're getting older. Um, so I just want to get some really good use out of them. Hopefully finish them up by the end of the year. But we'll see how it goes. Um, but anyways, if you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button and consider subscribing. And I will see you in my very next video. Have a good night. Bye.